right guys, Tung Dang here. I've always been curious about what an ambassador's house looks like, and today we have a very unique opportunity to find out just that. Follow me. A lovely space. Hello. Oh, hello. <laughs> yes, welcome, uh, welcome yeah. home. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Ambassador, for welcoming us into this very lovely home that you have. How long have you been living in Vietnam? I've been here, you know, as ambassador more than three years now. But it's my second time in Vietnam, so oh, overall really? I spent more than nine years. So could you show us a little bit about uh, your house? Please, please come in. Okay. So here's the main, uh, the main room. Okay. Uh, that's where we have... Uh, you know, oftentimes guests coming for, for uh, other ambassadors. Can you point to some of the, uh, the, the Vietnamese uh, decorations in your house? You can, you can see the bird cages that I saw in the mountains, especially ah. in uh, Hazang. So we really tried to put something Polish and, and what we came up with was, were Polish posters. I love Vietnam, it's, uh, in, it's my second home now. <laughs> but at the same time I, I feel more at home when I have some Polish elements. Uh, and here I forgot to show you the map. Ah, oh, you have uh, qu quite a few maps I noticed. So this is a map of, uh, what's it? Of Warsaw. Of it's Warsaw. A, it's an okay. old map of Warsaw. There's... So here you can, uh, you can see my favorite piece of art. Mm. There was an exhibition at the Museum of Fine Arts of Vietnam that we had. It was the main painting of that exhibition. Uh, could you tell me three things that you enjoy about living in Vietnam? Well, I, the, the, without doubt, I, I love the Vietnamese people and I love the Vietnamese culture and, uh, and Hanoi and, and, and also the Vietnamese food. So, uh, do you have anything to say to our Vietnamese audiences, the people that you've spent uh, quite a lot of time with? I hope we, we grow closer together.